portions of TV23's Internet provided by SWKO Wireless Internet. Covering the high plains with news, weather, and information. From TV23 Studios in Sublet, this is High Plains Today. Hey, that guy got it right. This is High Plains Today. Welcome, everybody. It is Wednesday, May 9th, 2018. On today's show, I'm joined by my good buddy Josh Rosner. He is with Rockingham Media, The Marshall, etc., etc. You know what they got coming up? First part of June, Horse Thief Festival. You want to know all about it? Stick around, because we're going to find out. In the meantime, let's see what's happening. A large group of faculty and community members attended last night's Garden City Community College Board of Trustees meeting. Incoming Faculty Senate President Philip Hoke read a faculty report. Now, he began by telling the board about the faculty's unsung work toward the college's accreditation. The Higher Learning Commission put the school on a two-year probation back in 2017, and peer reviewers will visit the campus again in November. Now, board members then were given packets. The packets contained documents that were extensive lists of faculty grievances, ultimately calling for the resignation or termination of Garden City Community College President Herbert Swender. Now, the packet was a concerted effort between the fact uh, by the faculty senate. The information was gathered for more than from more than 20 faculty members during a Senate executive session. It asked the board to listen to the many varied concerns and to take action specifically by firing and replacing Swender. Now, the 28-page document is a detailed primer of faculty grievances, all directed at Swender and the hostile work environment faculty members say he fostered. The report says Swender ignored faculty members' discomfort over mandatory prayers at in-services and threatened retaliation, including termination for those that spoke to the media and spread rumors about those who crossed him, as well as several other concerns. Now, a commu community petition is also currently circulating, calling for the resignation or termination of Swender. Athletic Director John Green and Vice President of Administrative Services Emily Klaus in light of the college's response to a sexual harassment allegation against former cheer coach, coach Bryce Knapp. Now, trustee Terry Wolf complained after hearing about the community letter that she has heard nothing negative. Now, the entire report and community letter can be viewed on our website, kdgltv.com forward slash news. And I'll tell you what, anybody with Garden City Community College or in Garden City, Email me, chris at kdgltv.com. You want to talk about this or clear all this up, give your side of it, let me know. All right, court proceedings were continued for 31-year-old Bashir Omar of Garden City, the man charged with second-degree murder after a fatal motorcycle accident in October of last year as court officials await a medical evaluation to determine whether he's competent to stand trial. Omar is charged with second-degree murder in connection with the death of 67-year-old Robert Becker of Garden City. Becker was riding a motorcycle southbound on Fleming Street when Omar ran him down from behind in a Jeep. Trouble finding Somali translators for hearings and difficulties scheduling a mental competency evaluation at Larned State Hospital have repeatedly complicated Omar's court proceedings as his second court appearance has been continued Five times. Hey, effective yesterday at 0800 hours, that's 8 o'clock, Station 4 in Buckland is now staffed 24-7, 365 with full-time staff. Chief Rob Boyd says they have been extremely fortunate to be able to staff that station for numerous years with a great group of dedicated volunteers. However, due to some unfortunate circumstances, they felt the public would be better served with full-time staffing. He goes on to say, please stop in and say hello if you are in the area. They would love to have you by. All right, a Kansas Highway Patrol trooper discovered hundreds of fake U.S. Social Security cards and birth certificates stashed in the glove box of a rental car he pulled over for speeding in the southwest part of the state late last month. Trooper Robert Krauss was on Highway 54 in Liberal, on the night of April 26th, when he spotted a 2017 Hyundai Sonata speeding and driving erratically. 
After pulling the vehicle over and getting permission to search the car, Krauss found six manila envelopes in the glove box. The fake documents were stuffed inside. Now, the pair facing charges in the case, Lilia Ariata and Sergio Adami of Mexico, were in the U.S. legally on visas and had crossed the Mexican border to travel into the U.S. 17 and 18 times, respectively, so far this year. Now, their latest entry into the U.S. was on April 25th, the day before they were stopped. In total, the cash contained 353 counterfeit or possibly counterfeit identification documents. Each is charged with unlawfully possessing identification documents. A national credit rating agency has upgraded Kansas from a negative to stable outlook. S&P Global Ratings affirmed its AA- issuer credit rating for the state and attributed the revised outlook to increased revenue. In the report issued Friday, it also cautions that the state's ability to manage its finances, given expected growth in expenses beginning in 2020, will be an important credit factor. In addition to looking at the issuer credit rating, S&P also revised the outlook on the state's appropriation secured debt to stable from negative and affirmed A-plus rating on that debt. Now, the AA- rating reflects the S&P opinion that Kansas' economy is showing weaker growth than the rest of the nation and a moderate concentration in the manufacturing sector, although the unemployment is below national average. And been to the gas pump lately? The latest data from AAA shows the Kansas average on gas price is $2.57 a gallon. The Sunflower State is below the national average of $2.81, but the recent jump is noticeable. Experts cite two main factors that are causing the current increase. The first of these is the Iran nuclear deal, which President Trump pulled out of yesterday. Oil prices have increased over the past few weeks because this move was anticipated. And crude oil this week topped $70 per barrel for the first time in four years. Oil prices generally lead gas prices, so since the price of oil has gone up, so have gas prices. And the Dodge City Fire, uh, Dodge City Fire Chief Robert Hines presented Deborah Callback with the Ford County Suicide Prevention Coalition with a check from the Dodge City Fire Department and Dodge City Police Department charity softball game held last Saturday. The check was for more than $1,500 and was presented yesterday. Good on you guys. All right, let's look at some of the stuff. You know, it's only beginning of May, but it's sure acting like it's August. So we back to look at the weather right after this and a chance of precipitation. You're watching High Plains today on TV23 with host Chris Jewell. TV 23's internet service and 4G live streaming provided by United Wireless. Coverage you deserve. Service you expect. United Wireless. Soldiers in the Army National Guard live up to a set of time-honored principles. I will always this first. They stand ready to respond to any crisis. I will never accept defeat. They serve in their communities as citizens and as soldiers. I will never quit. They train part-time to be ready to serve at all times. I will never leave a fallen comrade. Learn more at NationalGuard.com. Hi, I'm Nick Baumgartner, owner of Midwest Barter Exchange. So what is barter anyway? Midwest Barter helps you trade what you have for what you really need. You can use Midwest Barter Dollars to purchase hundreds of products for your business or personal use without the use of cash. You can even trade for TV advertising right here on KDGL TV 23. Find out more on our website or call 785-383-4965. Are you getting the most out of your Medicare plan? Are you sure? Many people with Medicare are eligible for plans that include extra benefits in addition to those found in original Medicare. Benefits like dental, vision, and prescription drug coverage. Call now to see if you're eligible to enroll. The consultation is free with no obligation to enroll. In addition to hospital and medical coverage, at no extra cost, you could also get coverage for prescription drugs, dental, hearing, 
vision, and more. In many areas, plans with benefits are available with $0 copays for many services, $0 monthly premiums, or $0 deductibles. That's hospital, medical, prescription drug, dental coverage, and more included in one plan with premiums that may be as low as $0 a month. Call now to see if you're eligible to enroll. The consultation is free and there's no obligation to enroll. Call 1-800-521-3583. That's 1-800-521-3583. Now, the local weather forecast for the High Plains. All right, we're looking off to the west on the TV23 Tower Cam. You can tell we need some precipitation. Got to get that camera cleaned off. Anyway, let's take a look at the readings here at the station. It's 82 degrees already today, 34% relative humidity. Winds are out of the south southeast at five. Barometric pressure is falling. Yeah, it's May 9th, people, 82 already. Looking at the current temperatures around the area, you see Periton already at 88. Everybody in the 80s, even out at Lamar, they're at 81. Current dew points, not too bad, but things are going to be changing as we look around the viewing area. You get a little more humidity as the further east we go. Always the case. Okay, winds are going to switch around a little bit today. They're in that process right now. They're east-southeasterly. They're going around to the north and to the northeast. You can see out at Lamar, though, not much wind out there. It is light and variable. Here's what we had recorded at the Garden City Regional Airport yesterday. We got to 89. Record was 99 back in 1963 and 2011. 56 was the overnight low. 33 back in 1984. Nothing new in the bucket. All right, here's what we got in store for today. 93 for the high. Winds are going to switch around to the south-southeast. Lots of sunshine, but... We are going to expect some precipitation tonight. Now, there's a 40% chance this stuff is going to build up in eastern Colorado, and it's going to be moving across the southeast late this afternoon, early evening, Garden City, Dodge City, Liberal, Mead, all the way across, even into Wichita. Could see some thunderstorms overnight, maybe spotty, severe here and there. Then tomorrow, 92 again. South winds at 15, lots of sunshine. Not going to cool down as much, 62 tomorrow night for the overnight low. But the wind's going to pick up. Look at that. It's going to be gusting up into the 30s. All right, as we look at the seven-day, yeah, you want to see that? 95 on Friday. Now, you get down close to the Oklahoma-Kansas border and into the panhandles, they could see triple digits down there. I ain't lying. I ain't making that up. Other than that, we're looking at sunshine. May have another thunderstorm chance coming into next week on Monday. That's a look at the weather. Stick around. Josh and I are going to come back. We're going to talk about Horse Thief Festival. When you have credit card debt, the debt suckers, high rate and high pay, never leave you alone. Debt is really sucking the life out of them. He's picking up the phone. Oh, no, not consolidated credit. With one call, they can lower their credit card rates. And consolidate their bills into one low payment. They'll pay off their debt in no time. Call consolidated credit now. Because debt sucks. Call 1-800-380-8565. That's 800-380-8565. Call now. 40 million. That's the number of free phones still available and the number of how many Americans can still get prescriptions free. Free could be wonderful. That's why I'm still working at 77 years old to pay off my prescriptions. I needed to have a, a prescription filled and I had to leave because I couldn't afford it. Call now and see what's available for you. Free prescriptions. Over 10 million people get prescriptions free and the program has expanded so another 40 million can. Free dental. Over 15,000 dentists have provided over three $330 million in free dental work, free cell phones. 40 million free cell phones are still available with free minutes and more. Free cell phone would change my life right now because it is something I cannot afford to get. Medical supplies like back braces, knee braces, and diabetic supplies may be covered too. The free RX Plus hotline has saved callers over $12 million on their prescription costs. These free programs are now available to 40 million more people. Call now.
College is great, but before you enroll, which do you think is a better way to earn your degree? Live on campus in a dorm where you can't sleep, with a roommate you can't stand, attend lectures that you can't hear, with cafeteria food that you can't eat, or learn online at Independence University. On the porch with your puppy, in the kitchen with your kitten, on your bed with your bunny, your campus is wherever you want it to be. Heck, you could earn your degree while wearing your PJs or while eating BLT with your baby because you don't go to college. College goes to you. Complete your courses around your schedule. That's a Independence. That's Independence University. No alarm clocks, no snoring roommate, no loud parties keeping you up all night, no note on your door telling you to sleep somewhere else. Instead, learn online at Independence University. Get your degree, but keep your life. And you'll also get a laptop and tablet to use in school, and you can keep them when you graduate. Learn online from professional instructors with real work experience. You get professional support in school and employment assistance when you graduate. Independence U. For an independent you. 1-800-234-3025. Hi, I'm Nick Baumgartner, owner of Midwest Barter Exchange. So what is barter anyway? Midwest Barter helps you trade what you have for what you really need. You can use Midwest Barter Dollars to purchase hundreds of products for your business or personal use without the use of cash. You can even trade for TV advertising right here on KDGL TV 23. Find out more at our website or call 785-383-4965. And we're back. Josh Rosner, Rocking M Media, The Marshall. Makes me want to go into my radio voice when I have him on the show. Horse Thief Festival, coming up. Coming up, the seventh annual already. I was going to say, this is like number seven, isn't Seventh it? annual, June 8th and 9th. And, uh, at the Horse Thief Reservoir. At the Horse Duh. Thief Reservoir. We just keep doing it. We're having fun. At Jetmore. So at Jetmore. Nine mm-hmm. miles west of Jetmore, Horse Thief Reservoir. Um, it's a great facility. Um They've been planting trees, and they've been building shade structures because the trees aren't big yet, <laughs> and uh, um, really doing a lot of really cool things out there, just making it a better better lake, a better park all the time, and um, we are bringing back the festival, June 8th and 9th, and we've got, of course, music is a big part of it. We've got two bands on oh, yeah. Friday night and three bands on Saturday night, and we're doing the fishing tournament. Thousands of dollars in cash and prizes for fishing. I like, I like how you say that. Thousands of dollars of That's cash the, and the radio, prizes. the radio, the yeah. radio promotion there. Sunday, so. Sunday. Absolutely. <laughs> so uh, the fishing tournament. Yeah. We've got mud volleyball. Uh, cool. Is always popular, and well, especially uh, if it's going to be hot. As, and it's always right? hot. And it's always <laughs> hot. <sighs> and then they start early morning. Well, the fishing starts early, early in the morning, right? Because fishermen are crazy, and. Yeah. Uh, or fish are, I guess, because they're the ones out that early, you know. Um, and then the, the the damn near 5K run. Oh, that's right. The damn uh, near 5K. Because the race is down the dam and back, yes. which is almost 5K. Oh, yeah, it's not quite 5K. 3.1 miles. Right. It's not quite. Not quite. So, so it's the damn near. Uh, we did it in the bluffs last year. Yes. And uh, people said that was tough. That was a, a rough, wasn't as fun. So, uh we moved it back to the dam this year, and uh, it's going to be a good time. And it's if you're a serious runner, fine. If you're not, that's fine too. Some people, their kids go. We had one whole family go. They just they kind of sauntered along, walked, ran, whatever, um, pushed there the strollers. Go. There was a uh, you know, yeah, go out and enjoy some nature. Absolutely at the Horse Thief Reservoir. Absolutely. Okay, but you can also during this whole deal, you can camp. Absolutely. Right? So uh, the utility campsites are sold out already, but nah, yeah, that fast. Wow. Um, there's 50 of them, I think. And they're, and they're gone. already gone. They're already gone. Gone. But you can dry camp. Um, you can run a generator if you want. I was say, I'm there not dry is, camping. Yeah, there is an uh, a unlimited space, basically, of, of primitive camping. Um, it's a big... Primitive. Yeah. They, oh God, they call it primitive that. camping. Um, I, you know, so at any rate, they'll just... You when know, we fill it up, we'll just mow another spot, and you can pitch your tent. <laughs> but you can park a camper in the primitive camping. You can run generators and stuff like that. Um... All the rules and regulations and prices are on the website, horsethiefthefestival.com. Yeah, horse, I, I was just going to say, horsethiefthereservoir.com. Horsethiefthefestival.com, horse horse like it says right there on the bottom of the screen. You got at it. At the Horse Thief Reservoir. Got it. All right, so let's talk about some of the bands you're going to have. Um, big, on Friday night. On Friday night. So we'll start with Friday. Uh, Bree Bagwell will open up the festival. 
Um, she's coming to us courtesy of Parker Haskins Insurance in Dodge City. Mm -hmm. Bree Bagwell is the six-time female vocalist of the year in the Texas Regional Radio Awards. Oh, um, she's really good. Um, she's one of on the well, she's one of the major artists in Texas right now, but she's probably one of the major females in Texas, but not just female. So she, and she's going to be moving oh, up. Oh yeah, oh yeah. All so right. she's very good. She's actually from New Mexico originally, but is in Texas now. So she's opening. Uh, the festival, and then Curtis Grimes will be headlining for Saturday night. He comes to us from First Dental, mm -hmm. uh, sponsored by First Dental. He played the festival the second year, and oh, so uh, he's a return. Act. He's a returning act, uh, backed by popular demand. There you go. So that those guys are on Friday, and we start. We just do two on Friday and start a little bit later. That way, everybody can get off work, get to the lake, get their campsite set up. Yeah, you know, get their their beer in the cooler on ice, and then get over to the concert. So, all right. So Saturday. All right. So then Saturday morning, though, you have the fishing tournament. Saturday morning at 530 a.m. The fishing oh. registration opens. The fishing contest starts at seven. You can pre-register for that online at horseleafthefestival.com. Uh, the run starts at eight with the race meeting at seven. You can pre-register for that at horseleafthefestival.com. The mud volleyball starts at nine. Pre-register your teams on the website, horseleafthefestival.com. <laughs> and... Uh, yeah, so those are through the day. Um, the church guys from many old, or from I'm sorry, from Jetmore, uh, do a biscuits and gravy breakfast, free will. Oh yeah, the Methodist on, men, the Methodists. That's yeah. right on Saturday morning. Yeah, so they're going to be back. We're going to have all kinds biscuits, of biscuits, gravy, all that yeah. stuff. And and it's oh so good. And it's it's free will. So throw a few dollars in the bucket and there you uh, go. Okay. Helps out their their crew. Um, and then the the music is in the evening, of course. Again, right. and we start with a local favorite, Buckner Creek. Where are they um, from? They are from Dodge, Spearville, okay, so Jetmore. When you say local, you uh, mean, we mean local. We meant local. So All Mike right. Benish is the lead singer. He's actually a math teacher in Spearville. So, um, and uh, oh, so he's a, he's a school teacher. His day job. In his day job. Oh, yes. Okay. All right. School teacher is the real they, job. Yeah. All right. Uh, All right. They played with us last year, and they came back. They're coming back again this year too. All right. Another um, back by popular demand. Absolutely, and they're so good. And they play everything. I mean, they have some of their own original stuff. They cover a lot of stuff. Classic country, modern country, classic rock. I mean, uh, you stand there, listen to them, and go, "Oh, this is really good." And then they play something else, and you go, "Oh, this wow, is, this is really this good." This is too. really good. <laughs> so, so you could just stand there and holler out a song, and they may play. It. Probably. Okay. I mean, they're that good. They right. really are. And uh, it's kind of fun. The Buckner Creek is the name of their band. The Buckner Creek was actually what they dammed to build Horse Thief Reservoir. So. Okay, so it's kind of a coming home for them. Yeah. All right, all right. So and they're, they're brought to you by First Dental, By right? First Dental as well. All right. And then you have, after them, Aaron, Aaron Copeland. Aaron Copeland. And Aaron I've heard Copeland, of him. Yes, he played Central Station last summer. Last during, summer? Was it during Dodge City I'm Days, I'm thinking Dodge City Days. It was That's the summer, thinking. anyway, because yeah. we were outside. So uh, he was a guitar player with, he's a young guy, but was a guitar player with uh, Casey Donahue for a long time. Okay. And now he's kind of doing his own deal. Um, has released two singles to the charts. Um, his current single is called Rain, and it's going to be a number one pretty soon. It's getting up there. Oh, yeah? You think and so? I do. This is your prediction. In my, pro my professional radio opinion. Right there. So there you go. <laughs> number one. Uh, so he'll be playing. He's uh, coming to us. Uh, brought to you by um, blank. DC Appliance. The Dodge City Appliance. I can't yeah. believe I forgot them. The all-new right DC I have, Appliance. I have it on my cheat sheet because I can't right. do this without it. The all-new Dodge City Appliance. Great That's store, it. by the way. Is it? Yeah. All right. And then, Thank you, uh, DC Appliance. There you go. There's a, there's a shameless plug for them, <laughs> right? right? Okay, and then you're going to close out. With Will Hogue. Okay. Um, Will Hogue is big in the Red Dirt, of course, but he's yes. big in the Americana music as well. And that gives kind of two separate genres that kind of overlap some. Yeah. He has written a lot of songs for other people. Uh, he's been nominated for a Grammy. Um, he oh, wrote, he has. Yes. He wrote... Uh, even if it breaks your heart, which the Eli Young band had a big hit with. Okay. Um, Chevy used one of his songs called "Strong" in their commercial in their ad campaign um, a few years ago, 2015, I guess, several years ago. So he's very good, and you'll recognize some of his music whether you realize it was him or not. <laughs> and you know what I mean? Oh like, yeah, it's going to be one of those. There you go. I know that song. Right. That's him. Yeah. That's, that's what you do, right? Yeah, a lot of go. that. That's him. And and he's had some some big success on the Texas charts as well. Okay. And uh, Cross Insurance Agency out of Kinsley is returning as a sponsor for him. They've been with us for several years. Lots of our sponsors have been with us for several years. Well, yeah. Dodge City Appliance is new because they're new. They're new, yeah. But uh, 
Um, the fishing tournament, uh, I get a sh shout out to Victory Electric and United Wireless. They are always a big sponsor of the fishing tournament and always come on board and help us out with that, um, as well as many other smaller sponsors with that. And the Dodge City Convention and Visitors Bureau um, kind of sponsor our stage area. We got to get the heck into Dodge. Yeah, absolutely. We'll so, get the heck into Horse Thief. Right. So All right. get the heck into Horse Thief, and when that's done, find a designated driver and get the heck into Dodge. There you go, Horse Thief. Uh, the festival coming up June 8th and 9th at the Horse Thief Reservoir, just nine miles from Jetmore, America. Seventh annual, right? Seventh annual. It's going to be a good time. Join us. Good to as see much you fun again. as the law will allow. There you go. I like seeing you. Right. Stick around. I'll be back after this. Are you in charge of fundraising for your soccer or baseball team, preschool, elementary, high school, cheerleaders, dance teams, or scouts? Are you all out of ideas? DollarsForYou.com is here to get the dollars for you. Visit DollarsForYou.com and look at all the fast and easy fundraising ideas together in one place. DollarsForYou.com is a Kansas-owned business that has been helping groups raise thousands of dollars for more than 30 years. Check out our trash bag special right now with 40 to 50% profit with bags 100 150% stronger than Glad or Hefty in team colors, and they're made right here in Kansas. Guaranteed moneymakers include tumblers, cookies, chocolates, and there's no upfront cost. We've got favorites like cookies from Mrs. Fields and Otis Spunkmeyer, signature chocolates, pop and popcorn, and school spirit tumblers. Peggy and her team have the experience to help your team meet your fundraising goals quickly and easily. Visit dollarsforyou.com today and let us help get more dollars for you. Are you getting the most out of your Medicare plan? Are you sure? Many people with Medicare are eligible for plans that include extra benefits in addition to those found in original Medicare. Benefits like dental, vision, and prescription drug coverage. Call now to see if you're eligible to enroll. The consultation is free with no obligation to enroll. In addition to hospital and medical coverage, at no extra cost, you could also get coverage for prescription drugs, dental, hearing, vision, and more. In many areas, plans with benefits are available with $0 copays for many services, $0 monthly premiums, or $0 deductibles. That's hospital, medical, prescription drug, dental coverage, and more included in one plan with premiums that may be as low as $0 a month. Call now to see if you're eligible to enroll. The consultation is free and there's no obligation to enroll. Call 1-800-521-3583. That's 1-800-521-3583. Remember, Horse Thief Festival coming up June 8th and 9th. If you want to learn all about it, you can get on the webpage, horsethiefthefestival.com. tells you everything you need to know. Fishing tournament, camping, all the bands, everything. Let's take a last look at our weather. 83 degrees, it's warmed up a degree. This is nuts, May 9th. Relative humidity, not bad, though, 32%. Winds are out of the southeast today. Barometric pressure is still falling. Looking at the seven-day, though, you know we do have a 40% chance of some precipitation. Starting in eastern Colorado and then working its way overnight to the east. And other than that, it's going to maybe be 100 on Friday. Go out and have a good day. See you tomorrow. Keep up to date with the latest information from TV23 on our Facebook page, KDGL-TV. Take your internet by the reins. Pioneer Communications offers blazing fast speeds up to 50 meg. Make slow internet a thing of the past and sign up for faster internet today. Pioneer Communications, your community connected. HeinenRepair.com is your one stop for the right equipment for work and play. We've got tractors, UTVs, attachments, and lawnmowers with one of the best service departments in the area. And don't forget, our Mahindra tractors are number one in the world. I got a toy for me and a tool for my man. Heinen Repairs, located just south of Valley Falls, Kansas, on Highway K4. Check out our inventory at HeinenRepair.com or call us at 785-945-6711. Heinen Repair, come see us today. 
When you have credit card debt, the debt suckers, high rate and high pay, never leave you alone. Debt is really sucking the life out of them. He's picking up the phone. Oh, no, not consolidated credit. With one call, they can lower their credit card rates. And consolidate their bills into one more payment. They'll pay off their debt in no time. Call consolidated credit now. Because debt sucks. Call 1-800-380-8565. That's 800-380-8565. Call now. College is great, but before you enroll, which do you think is a better way to earn your degree? Live on campus in a dorm where you can't sleep, with a roommate you can't stand, attend lectures that you can't hear, with cafeteria food that you can't eat, or learn online at Independence University. On the porch with your puppy, in the kitchen with your kitten, on your bed with your bunny, your campus is wherever you want it to be. That's Independence University. And you'll also get a laptop and tablet to use in school, and you can keep them when you graduate. 1-800-274-8142. Portions of TV23's Internet provided by SWKO Wireless Internet. Covering the high plains with 